Hi guys, so it's shower. Um, nice to see you all. I hope you are all having a good day. Um, I'm a little tired today, but I thought I'd still come on and do a little video and cheer you all up. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to talk about, but I just felt there the urge to come on and have a little talk. Um, oh, do you like my outfit? I styled my little pants that I bought the other day. With a little crop top, crop tops are my favourite thing. I've all, ever since being little, I've um, loved a crop top. And I love these pants, look at these pants. Ooh, I love a pants and I've also, look at my bad boy boots. Look at them, are they cool or what? So I've got two pairs of boots. They're the same, I've got one uh, leopard print and I've got a black pair because you've got to have two pairs of bad boots, haven't you? So I put them on, so I think that's pretty cool. Um, left my hair a bit wavy today because I can't be fucking go as straight in as you have. Like my little Irish voice. Um, we're going to learn a tango. We're going to learn a fucking tango. Um, yeah, so my little talk today, I just feel like on my heart, I just feel like. I don't know, just people like trying to wind you up and people trying to piss you off and stuff and people trying to be hurtful to you and it's like if you allow them to get you down they will get you down, you know, there is twisted people in the world who don't like to see other people doing better, you know, and the importance of not rising to them, you know, there's times where I want to rise to the bit. I want to kick off, I want to fucking smack a bitch up, but I don't, I try not to, <laughs> on a daily basis, I try to be, um, I try to be together, but it's not always, it's not always possible, um, yeah, do you like my crap top, it matches the skirt I've got, um, and I thought I'd put it on with these black PVC pants um, and my little choker and my little big earrings as usual put my makeup a bit of makeup on, put a bit of glam on feel a bit better about yourself um, yeah, so just the importance of not letting negativity drag you down and pressure and give you shit and stuff it's like some days I do feel down, you know, today I woke up and I felt like miserable, I'm tired, I've been working really hard, um, I'm stressed out because I've got, no, I've got to go out, I've got to go and get some stuff and I don't want to go out, I don't want to go out in the environment that we're in, I just want to stay at home and chill out and just, do you know what I mean, take it easy, but I've got to go out because I've got to get some things, um, really I don't want to, I want to stay in, um, but yeah, um, and the importance of people not trying to that's what I was saying the importance of people not trying to bully you and take you down and stuff because it's like people have gone to the extreme level with me do you know what I mean they've gone to the extreme they've tried to hurt me they've tried to like twist my reputation they've tried to make me look bad they've tried to be really horrible to me and it's not nice do you know what I mean it's really not nice to have people use my stuff against me and try and start fights from in the street and it's like Bring it. If you think that you want to have a fight with me, bring it. That's that's first and foremost. I walk back down to no one. I'll be backing down to no one. I will. I walk back down to any fight. That is the truth. Um, but I don't want to be doing that. Do you know what I mean? I don't want to be kicking off in the town. I don't want to be kicking off and um, having that kind of negativity around me because there's actually like, no benefit that will come from it. I will feel better because my pride will just be like, I'll fucking smack the bitch. But there will actually be no 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 uh, positive outcome because i'll probably end up arrested i'll end up in the police cell do you know and i'm too pretty for that shit i'm too pretty i'm too intelligent i'm too special i'm too this that and the other to end up kicking off for some people who just want to drag you down and break your spirit but do you know what i mean it's like if you wanted to be excuse me if you wanted to be yourself do you know Go out and be yourself, do what makes you happy in life, you know, focus on what's good for you instead of focusing on me and my life and what I'm doing and where I'm going and stuff because I'm on a different road, I'm on the road to the riches baby and I'm not stopping for anyone, um, so yeah, so 
yeah it's hard work it's really hard work um people just want to rise out here they want they want to use you as bait to kick off and fight and all that kind of stuff which because i've got like a little bit of a temper i won't say i'm well, I'd say <laughs> I'm so <still> afraid. <laughs> I'm afraid to fucking kick off. Um, let's put it that way. Um, but people try and use that against you. They want to rattle you up. They want to rev you up. They want to piss you off because they want to see you explode. They want to see you. Do you know what I mean? You can't keep taking 10 steps back. You can't keep taking 10, step, 10 steps back with people. Do you know? Because if you kick off, you act like a dick. And then you're last in a mess, you're in a pickle, you know, you don't want to be doing that. You want to be strong, you know, you want to be, you want to be beautiful, you want to be strong, beautiful, you want to be talented, like it's saying. Um, people are jealous when you're like successful and you're doing well in your life and you're moving forward and people are stuck, they're stuck in the old ways, you know, some people are just really messed up in the head and you've got to stay away from them people, do you know what I mean, because some people are beyond help, we all know, we've all lived on the fucking, we all lived that kind of life where we know people and you look at them and you think you're a no hope. do you know what I mean, you try and help them but there's no hope for some people, you just got to leave them to them, you've got to say, do you know what I mean, I speak to my preacher when he goes show all the differences. He says, I know someone who's coming to dump shit on there. Someone who, he doesn't say it like that, obviously, it's isn't more practical than that. But he says, do you know what, show all? He goes, I know someone who's coming just to dump on me. And I know someone who's coming to, who actually wants to change, you know, actually wants to change their life around, you know. I'm a prime example of that. I've, I was a little be when i was a kid you know i didn't care about anything I didn't, and i'm proud of it i am proud of it do you know what i mean i'm not like not proud of my past and i'm not proud of who i am do you know what i mean i don't care i'll still i still don't care do you know what i mean i'm proud of who i am i'm proud of what i've been through i'm proud of what i've walked through i'm proud of everything and people try and shame you into thinking oh do you know don't be proud of who you are uh, don't be proud of this don't be proud of that do you know feel bad about yourself no if you are a barbie gangster be proud of it do you know what i mean don't be scared of it if you don't care what people think of you or if you don't care that i'm not like condoning violence but if you're not scared and you're just going to be yourself and you're going to be a Barbie gangster, that's what I think, then be that. Do you know what I mean? Don't be scared. Don't be afraid. Don't be intimidated by anyone. Do you know, if you need to turn it up, fucking turn it up on their arse. But don't do that just for no reason. Do you know, if someone brings it to you, then someone brings it to you. But apart from that, do you know, just keep keep on moving, keep on being happy, keep on being precious. Do you know, God says we are precious, we are loved. Do you know, there's no one in this world more. He says it, our names are written on his hand, do you know, in his palm of his hands. I can imagine him all day just like, let's have some big hands, have all our names on it. So looking and saying, oh yeah, that's written on my hand, do you know what I mean? So he knows, he knows all about us, he knows what we're like inside, he knows our heart, he knows we're pure. Do you know, people get me twisted, people get me wrong because I'm because I'm a bit ruthless in my thinking, do you know what I mean? Not ruthless as in I'll fucking hurt somebody, but ruthless as in fuck her, go fuck yourself, do you know what I mean? That people get it twisted about me and think, oh, she's a fucking horrible cow, she's just that. No, I've helped people, I've done this, I've done that, do you know what I mean? I've been a good person to a lot of people, and a lot of people have pissed me off and took advantage. So now I'm like, mm, I don't think so now. Now you took the piss once, you won't come and take it a fucking again. And that's the truth. Um, you know this pussy is juicy I still love my music yeah don't be afraid don't be afraid to be yourself don't be afraid to be beautiful don't be afraid to be scared do you know what I mean don't be afraid to be who you are do you know there's different personas you know when you're at work you've got to you've got to be you know, professional and all that kind of stuff but the second you come out of work boom get ready for it get your fucking clothes on get your hair on do whatever you need to do do you know what I mean don't be afraid to be yourself do you know 20 2020. I've loved 2020. 2020 has been the fucking bomb diggity. Um, I've enjoyed myself more than ever. Do you know, I've got closer relationships. I've got rid of loads of quality over quantity. My sister says quality over quantity. Do you know what I mean? I don't really care what people have got to say about me because people will talk. And if they're not talking about you, you're not doing anything right. <laughs> 
So yeah, so I, I feel like that's my little rant over. I feel like I've shown you my cute little outfit. Show me my little matching boots. I probably will go out like this and I will get some stairs, but it's like, fuck them, fuck them all. Do you know, do they pay my bills? Do they pay my rent? Do they pay for my life? Do they do anything for me? Why should you care? And you're on lockdown as well, so there's not that many people uh, out to stare and glare. It suits the stare. You know what the man I used to say? It suits the wearer, not the stare. -er. So there you go. So there's my little talk for today. I feel like I look really cute today with my little outfit. My hair's a bit wild, but sometimes the wild look is the best. You know, you've got to be, you've got to be yourself. You can't care what other people think of you. Do you know, people want to drag you down. They want to pull you down. They want to pull your fucking hair. They want to, they just want to be jealous and envious of you. You're coming up and your success and your, do you know, your style and your, your what's the word, your penas, is it penas? <laughs> I don't even know what it means, but I'm sure it means like something fucking good about yourself. Do you know what I mean? Because some people have got no personality. I've seen more character in a fucking carrot than I have in some people. I've seen more personality in a fucking dog. Then I have some people, I know it sounds nasty and horrible, but I am, I've, some people have no personality and they want to come for you, they want to come for you, your beautiful hair, don't let them touch your hair, do you know what I mean, don't let them come anywhere near you. So yeah, so there's our little video for the day, look at me, I think I'm fucking Pamela Randis, oh, I love Pamela Randis and she's beautiful, isn't she, when she was younger, so fucking beautiful. Slinging. Yes, yeah, so there's my little video. Hopefully, it's cheered you up. It's cheered me up a bit. So, a few years and uh, being my usual self. Um, so, I'll let you go. Um, just remember to be you today. Don't be anyone else. Don't try and be like the mother girls. Don't try and be like anyone else but yourself. You know, that is the most important thing is to be yourself. Be who you are. Take no shit. Make um, that motherfucker Take no shit off anyone. Love you.